were in high school when they met And things got kinda awkward With sparks in the air He would stare at her in class And she would try to act cool But it was obvious like ooh They would be together One day she said, write me a love song, cause I know you'll make it beautiful. Hey friends, I'm Shelly Shoosh. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to another day in the life vlog. Good morning, Luna. Luna just woke up. She's having her breakfast. Maverick is starting to turn in his uh, crib right now. He had his six months checkup yesterday. Little dude is 22 pounds in the 98th percentile. He is just a very large baby. Luna weighs 31 pounds for size reference. So he's only nine pounds smaller than her and two and a half years younger. It's crazy. I don't know how I'm gonna feed him when he becomes a teenager. Um, he is still having problems sleeping through the night. The doctor said that he thinks he is just really hungry. And so, Today, I'm going to start feeding him a lot more solid foods. I was doing pretty much only one solid meal with him a day, sometimes two. I'm gonna bump that up to four. So my plan is to feed him oatmeal when he first wakes up in the morning. When Luna's having lunch, I'm going to give him a fruit. When we are having dinner, I'm going to give him a vegetable. And then before he goes down for the night, I'm going to give him oatmeal again and then just breastfeed him throughout the day. And hopefully that starts to take care of the, the night wakings. I don't know how I went from a baby that slept through the night from two weeks old to just all of a sudden just not. But I guess in order to sustain all of his 22 pounds, he needs a lot of extra food. So that's on the docket for today. I have a grocery order coming in today, so I will be sharing a haul with you guys. Um, and then just some around the house happenings. So, if you guys are interested in any of these things, then just keep watching. For breakfast this morning, Luna's having some Greek yogurt. I believe it's like a peach flavor. Um, she's on a little bit of a Cheerios kick, so I gave her a bunch of Cheerios in one of these cute little Easter cups. And then a mandarin orange. We are getting our groceries in today, so we're a little bit slim pickings on breakfast food. I ordered her a bunch of everything, so this will be good for her today. Isn't this a good life? Sitting on the front porch, sipping on the rocks. Citrus in our beverages. Citrus in our beverages. Show only the good sides. Always pretty smiles are covering our faces. You know it is our lies. You know it is all lies On and on and on it goes Round and round the rodeo Breathing out air for a minute Taking my time to begin with On and on and on it goes Swinging down in life, you know Breathing out air for a minute Yeah Hey, would you rather stay right here? Make everything disappear Can play my favorite song Put your rose colored glasses on What if we stay right here? Make everything disappear Lay low in the beaching sun Put your rose colored glasses on So this KiwiCo subscription actually came with three different activities. You guys saw us do one of the activities a couple weeks ago and I've been saving this last one. So we are actually going to make a tote bag, I believe. And I think it's gonna have to deal with rainbow colors. So let me set up the camera and you guys can follow along. Okay, so I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna wet this and put it on a tray. And then I'm gonna put some water in this and then you're gonna use the dropper, okay? So just give me a minute, let me get the stuff. Drop the water on the pieces of tissue. Okay. Good job, honey. What do you think? Yeah, keep going. <gasps> Good job, and wet all the paper. Good 
good, Liz. We were flowers. Okay, just a second. So we're all done with that, and now we are to wait until tomorrow when it is all dry, and then we'll see how all the colors came out, and then we'll put some cloud stickers on it. Also, yes, my child is still in her pajamas because she only ever wants to wear pajamas now. So, yesterday her keka came over and she brought her flowers and they started to open up. So she wanted to show the vlog how her flowers are opening up. They're beautiful, Loons. So Luna's keka also brought her a cookie decorating kit yesterday. So we are going to decorate some Easter egg shaped cookies. What color are you going to use? Blue. You're going to use blue? And we'll use purple too. Ooh, okay. I guess I get to use yellow then. What color do you want, Maverick? It doesn't matter. You don't eat cookies. Bugger, those are my sprinkles! Oh my gosh. Okay, here we go. To get a little lost in everybody's business. Why don't we all calm down? Why don't we all calm down? I'm the wrong size Not enough room for everybody's egos Why don't we all calm down? Why don't we all calm down? On and on and on it goes Can you show me your cookie? Wow, that's beautiful. How does it taste? <laughs> does it taste yummy? Not as yummy as the icing? Yeah. Of course, we didn't have enough sprinkles, so let's use both yours and mine all on one cookie. Oh, wow, Loons. Are you going to eat that? You are? Okay, let me make you lunch, and you can have it with your lunch. I bet you think that I should calm down And that I'm overthinking everything about you Okay, so for lunch, Luna is having a tuna sandwich on some seven grain bread. She loves peas and carrots, especially the carrots, and then her very overdone cookie. <laughs> Hello, sir. Mama's just gonna do a quick grocery haul for the people, okay? Can you give me two minutes? Thank you. Okay, so my groceries just got here. It's a pretty typical haul. Don't mind Maverick, he's in the kitchen. He's perfectly fine, he's just making noise. So, this is a pretty typical haul, besides the fact that it would be like double this because it's a lot, it was a long weekend and I didn't do my groceries on Saturday, having them delivered on Monday like I usually do. So I actually ordered them yesterday, so it's midway through the week. I only needed half of the food. So, I spent, $177 and this will be enough food to get us into the beginning of next week and I'll just give you guys a quick haul, okay? What we always really need to stock up on is our produce because we go through so much produce. So we've got some bananas, some raspberries, some cherry tomatoes, strawberries, green onions, red grapes, Cucumbers, they came in a pack of three. They didn't have singles for some reason. Also some baby spinach because we're gonna be doing smoothies next week, me and Luna. And then she loves red pepper, so we got a red pepper. We always get two kefirs because Luna drinks kefir instead of like milk. No one in my house actually drinks cow's milk, but I always get a small milk just for recipes and stuff. I got some crumbled feta cheese because with all of these cucumbers, being that they would only give me three at a time, I knew I was going to have to make some sort of a dish with them, so I'm going to make a Greek salad. Um, Luna has one of these drinkable yogurts every morning as well. She asked me for tzatziki. I'm seeing a yogurt trend here. My kid really likes yogurt. Let me know if your kids do too. Also, I told you guys before, she's not into sliced turkey anymore, so we switched to ham. And also I got some of these cheddar um, 
just portions. These are mostly for me, but Luna can eat them as well. Over here, I have the meat for the next couple of days. So I've got some chicken breasts, some ground beef for Monday because I always do a pasta on Monday. And then I'm gonna do some French onion pork chops either tomorrow or on Friday. And then, so this is for that recipe. I also got Luna some of these mini pancakes. We've bought these one time before and she really enjoyed them. Something you guys might not know about me is that corn is my absolute favorite food, corn and canned tuna. So I wanted to try this frozen corn with jalapenos because I could literally just eat this whole bag just on its own, I'm sure of it. And then my husband is the only person in our house that eats eggs, so I got him some eggs. Also, we're gonna need to dye some eggs this weekend because it is Orthodox Easter. Over here are all the snacks that I got as well as the kids food. So I got pretzels, which is a favorite of mine ever since I've had Maverick. You guys have heard me rave about these plant-based cheddar corn puffs. They are my absolute favorite. So as always, we got two packages. One is cheddar and jalapeno. The other one is just plain cheddar. I'm going to make some oatmeal muffins with Luna this week. Uh, we always get a few pouches to put in the diaper bag. Maverick is teething, so I always wanna make sure I have Tylenol on hand. I got some prune juice to put in smoothies as well and I wanted to try a flavored oatmeal for Maverick so I got this one with mango and carrot and then just one of the regular ones because like I told you this morning we're going to be doing a lot more oatmeal soon. Last but not least I have two marinara sauces because they are my favorite the president's choice and I will just keep these in the pantry until I need them. Oh and I also got a bag of ice because I always get a bag of ice. And Luna was just ever so patiently waiting for me to finish that haul so she could ask for more. She wants more peas and carrots and she finished her sandwich. She doesn't want any more bread, but she wants more tuna. That is my child. So Maverick is trying apples for the first time. I made him applesauce yesterday. He seems to think Luna's cookie looks a lot better. What do you think, bud? Let's try that. What do we think? Are you not a fan of apples? I don't know. You don't know? No. I see you. I see Maverick. <laughs> I don't think he likes them. <laughs> I think he's staring at them. Oh my god. I'm laughing so hard at this because apples are the, the second fruit that I've given him that he's just like not into it. I, I have given both of my kids all the vegetables first before introducing fruit to them because I don't want them to get used to the sugar and only want to eat sugary things. But now I think it had the opposite effect because now he only wants to eat the vegetables and he's not into the fruits at all. Oh my goodness, I don't know what I'm gonna do about this. Maybe I'll try mixing it with like carrots next time and see if he's into that. So I didn't show you guys when I was making dinner because it was super simple and I just wanted to share the after with you. What we're having tonight is called podvorak and it is a Serbian meal. Basically all I did was saute some onions in some fat and then I added some pork pieces and then I added like a jar of cabbage and this cabbage is just salted cabbage, they call it sour cabbage and I mix it around for a little bit, added some pepper, some paprika, and then I put it in the oven covered for 20 minutes at a time for an hour. And every 20 minutes I would open it and give it a stir, put it back in. The last 20 minutes I took the cover off and just let it brown on the top. And we are ready to eat. My husband's gonna eat it just like this, but I'm going to eat it with some brown rice. So it is actually the next day and the day just got away from me yesterday and I didn't end up closing out the vlog. So I just wanted to come on here quickly and say thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you are new around here and I will catch up with you guys soon in a new video. Bye!